population is expected to increase to 9 billion around 2050, and almost all of these people will be born in today's developing countries. A significant number of them will also be more prosperous than today, and their diets will shift towards resource-intensive Western-style foods. Climate change will complicate matters further, with the worst impacts likely to be on the regions the least well-equipped to cope. Moreover, farmers will have to compete for increasingly limited water and other resources as the world's urban areas expand and the economy grows. Can agriculture meet these challenges? Histories suggest it can. Food production has not only kept pace with population growth, it has outstripped it. Today, a farmer feeds about 155 people worldwide, compared with only 26 in 1960. Today, the world produces 50% more calories than are actually needed to feed everyone. In fact, there are now more people overweight in the world than suffer from hunger. Growth and poverty reduction have been important. So also have developments in farming practices and technologies. Improved seeds, fertilizers, and pesticides, new ways of breeding and rearing animals, and better ways of organizing the production, storage, and distribution of agricultural produce are emerging. New technologies, precision farming, drones, big data, will make it possible to create the conditions for sustainable productivity growth, even in the face of climate change. However, the future of agriculture will depend on the path that we choose. International cooperation will become more important. We need to ensure that products can be traded efficiently so that food can be moved to where it is needed. Our energy choices will also play a big role. Will we continue to chase productivity growth through fossil fuel-based technologies? Or will the energy revolution transform the way we grow our crops? A shift in consumer mindset may also play a significant part in the future of agriculture. A more sustainable approach to consumption could alleviate some of the burden that is placed on the agricultural system and increase demand for ecologically viable production models. But regardless of the path we choose, a lot will be asked of the agricultural sector in the future. Apart from ensuring reliable supplies of high-quality, affordable food, agriculture will be expected to provide inputs for energy and industry, manage the environment and protect biodiversity, and contribute to economically viable rural development. To make all of this possible, governments have to create a policy environment that encourages the spread of innovation, enables farmers to be competitive and profitable, boosts sustainable productivity, and promotes well-functioning domestic and international markets. It is time to change the policy paradigm for the future of agriculture. <laughs>